guys and welcome back to my channel so you're here with all things about Karen Wind so today's video is going to be on a TCA peel so we're going to be doing a TCA peel which by the way um, I don't know I think it was two weeks ago a week ago I did the the, uh, the derma roller the micro needling derma roller and let me tell you, it actually helped. Remember, I don't know if you guys could go back to the video. I had some little things going on. Not a lot, but it was more. And look, my face, like, even my forehead is like, Ooh. So, yeah. Um, so, stay tuned. Okay, guys. So, I just want to do a little disclaimer. I'm not a licensed esthetician nor a dermatologist. So anything I do in this video content is done by me and only me because I like to do DIYs. I like to um, explore different um, avenues on anti-aging and DIYs at home. So, yeah. So I wanted to say TCA peels, okay? But I want to touch on certain things really quick because I know I always say that and I feel like I've been talking a lot. But, all right. So, I know I've been doing a lot of hyaluron and, and hyaluron, uh, hyaluronic acid fillers on my lips and whatnot. Right. So, I just want to let you guys know, um, first of all, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Because I've gotten so many great responses and comments on my hyaluron video, on my hyaluron panel, excuse me, videos. And I greatly appreciate all your great vibes. And to my uh, 36 subscribers, thank you guys for believing in me. But now that I have over a thousand views on one of my videos, 1.7K, please, I need you guys to subscribe because that's the only way I'm going to continue buying these little things and whatnot. And I'm trying to reach that so I can continue doing better content for you guys. Another thing. I know that I've been a culprit of that in the past because I've been on YouTube since 2014 but I did not start doing videos to this year. So now with that being said, I'm also, I have been in the past, a culprit of viewing and viewing and viewing and um, not subscribing but then I go back and view the same person over and over and I think that partially it's not fair because <clears throat> we and all those people do um, these video contents for you guys and it's important to see that you guys are supporting each other especially with small youtubers you know excuse me prime example we're so quick to go in no shade no pun intended and um hope i don't get in trouble but we're so quick to go and click subscribe to um the kardashians or to the jenners or to any celebrity out there we're so quick like five seconds um uh, They'll do a five second song, you know, and all of a sudden, whoop, we're subscribing and like, oh yeah, it's the best thing since sliced bread. Guys, it's reality TV. It's all scripted at the end of the day. And these videos here that we put up on YouTube are real life. And we're trying to get supported and bringing you, you know, what I think myself is decent content, at least on my behalf, because I'm not all up there. I'm still learning. And whatnot. So yeah. So I'm sorry for the spiel. But anyway, we got for the two. Let's get this going. And I am scared. So a TCA peel. It's good for the skin. Good for anti-aging scars, hyperpigmentation. It rejuvenates your skin. So a TCA peel is a non-invasive. I'm reading with you guys something. A TCA peel is a non-invasive. Skin treatment used to treat skin discoloration, scarring, wrinkles. These pills, <clears throat> wait, which is used to clear away dead skin cells to reveal the newer and smoother skin layers below. Okay, it's really good. Also, as you know that I do fillers and stuff. So before another another little disclaimer, before you do a TCA peel, ask your dermatologist or ask a professional before you do anything to your skin, you know? And if this is the first time you do a TCA peel, like I've done TCA peels before and they burn like hell, you know what I mean? Um, but 
the TCA peel that I'm using right now is a level one, which is the TCA 5%. Okay, that's like for starters. The reason why I'm doing this because, you know, since I've been doing other type of regimens to my face, I don't want to really burn, but I just want to kind of start little by little and then work my way up. Also, please guys, when are you doing a TCA peel, like I said before, ask your dermatologist. Never go, um, I've heard over, I think, 20, some people go up, it depends on the, on the peel as well. You don't wanna mess up your face, catch an infection, whatever. Higher grade of TCA peels are better, are like for the, the, the bottom of your skin, because as you know, the bottom, body, um, you know, yeah. Because as you know, your skin on your face is totally different from the skin on your body. It's more sensitive, more, you know, delicate. All right, what's another thing? As you know, I do fillers and whatnot. We have to be careful. Like with this TCA peel, you know, me asking and doing research, if you have Botox or whatnot, you could do it. But now, if you're gonna use a higher grade, a filler, don't do it, you know, it's, it's not good, all right? All right, so without further ado, I stopped talking, Karen. All right, boom. So now, you need to, when you're gonna start TCA peel, you need to cleanse your face thoroughly. I already, well, I took a shower and I also, um, cleanse my face and you're gonna need like a, a skin cleanser it's very gentle um, Compared to Cetaphil you could do Cetaphil or you could do this I used to do generic is the same thing very you know doesn't have any aroma any perfumes or anything Okay, I don't think that for the TCA 5% I'm gonna need to numb but sometimes people do numb You know, but in this case, I'm not gonna numb um, Also just another little disclaimer People always tend to say, oh, I want to do a TCA peel. So people tend to look for the frothing or the blanch, you know, sometimes blanching is when um, it sticks to your face and it doesn't just rub off, you know? But you always want to look for that frost. Not everybody frosts, so that doesn't mean that your TCA peel is not working. Just letting you guys know that. All right, so without further ado, oops. I'll be back. I forgot my baking soda. My new soda. Hey guys, I'm back. So, yeah, I had to, I forgot. Okay, so, from most of my research with this TCA peel, not always you have to neutralize. That's what they say, it neutralizes itself. But, like I always tell you guys, I'm a chicken. So, I'm going to be having my, um, this. And it's going to be like a creamy texture. You put it on after, you know, you can't take it off. <laughs> Alright, so without further ado, let's do this. So we're gonna put the gloves on. You know me. Gotta take care. You know when you're working with stuff like this and whatnot, and you know, the TCA peels are so you know potent and stuff like that. You don't wanna bring your fingers or anything. So gloves. Okay. Hmm. Alright. So, we're gonna need some, uh, I got this Burt Bees Micellar Cleansing Waters, 3 more removes makeup, cleanliness, and hydrates. But, you know what? I was, let's use the alcohol, because it actually, like, takes everything off, you know what I mean? So. Oh, I'm so scared. Make sure to clean. And you're gonna need your swabs. And make sure, guys, when you do the this, you know, be careful with your eyes, please. If you have microblading in your in your eyebrows, if you have any microblading, any tattoos, make sure you put coconut oil on your eyebrows so it doesn't, you know, take it out. Because TCA peel, like on a higher grade, is good for the body. If you want to remove some tattoos, I've seen it. But today, I'm only gonna do my face, guys, okay? So, huh, wash my face, do it one more time. And always remember, when you're doing a TCA peel, after you do it, make sure you have, um, try to avoid some light, okay? One, two, make sure 
that you have a good SPF, good moisturizer. And like for instance, I have aloe, I have these little um, rosehip nourishing, antioxidant rich in fatty acids, helps reduce the signs of aging, also soothes. And I have my moisturizing cream here, okay? And you see I have my, and it has SPF and whatnot, so. And I'm not going outside today, so. Okay, finish your back. All right, so now you're gonna need some more cotton rounds or Usually with the TCA peel, they do the fan brush, but that's while they're laying down on the table. I don't recommend it, me personally, when you're sitting down because, you know, you're like this, it could fall in your eyes, and God forbid, go blind. <laughs> I don't want to be responsible for that. Um, so, is the lost product? Hmm, yeah, a little bit, but is it worth it? Because I don't want my eyes, you know. Alrighty guys, so without further ado, and usually I would put it like in a little glass container and dip this. And I'm going to start on the forehead, okay? And then if you want to apply, you can apply within the 10 minutes, five layers, okay? But if it's uncomfortable for you, even at the lowest level, just neutralize it and get out of it. You know what I mean? Always do a patch test the night before and you're out. <sighs> okay, let's do this. Be careful with your eyes, guys. One, two, three. Okay. Do it in the forehead because almost the forehead is almost like the back of the head, you know? something on your lips it's starting to burn like it's activating when you can feel it feels like a little sunburn like little stings right about now okay let that go something biting your face this is not that bad the higher ones like a 710 those are a little bit more intense and as you go up it's more intense I've never done more than a 10 because <laughs> I see a lot of people even crying and just monitor your, your face that my hair is discolored is because I'm starting to take the color out the red one so last night I did my DIY you know and um, but with that being said this is not about that so but I'm going to cut my hair and go back to blonde it's not a natural blonde guys but I love the color and how it just brings out my skin complexion you know and I'm Puerto Rican, so when I go to the island like I did in March, it makes me look great. You know, with that little sun kiss. This is my color, guys. It's inviting. Okay. So I'm going to work fast. Now. Okay. So. So now you're gonna need a hair dryer and you're gonna put it on cool, okay? Not hot, cool guys.
guys can see, you see this right here? Maybe this one, I don't know, right around there. You see that white right there? Cause that's getting a little bit of froth, but it's not a lot. I do feel the face like a little tight. It makes it like a little tight and whatnot. So I'm gonna do one more round of it. And then I'm calling it because it is woo! It still stings. So, yeah. And then after a few days, you're gonna see that your skin is going to peel. Do not pick on your face, okay guys? Do not pick on your face. You could give it an infection, it could get so bad. You don't want that, okay? So let's do it one more time. Neutralizes it. best 
uh, advice to you is don't use lukewarm use cold water because your face is already burning as it is you know and it, this was intense because I haven't done it in a while so you can see my face is almost warm and it feels tight it feels nice and firm you know so now anyway so without I'm gonna put some moisturizer on my face and this is the age control day a lot day logic day and night cream nourishing cream okay no smell or anything make sure it's nothing in it okay warm it up and I pat it in okay because I don't want to rub my face because it's already kind of sensitive you know This helps reduce the signs of aging and it moisturizes. It keeps your face hydrated. That is your main key in these next couple of days. Is keep your skin hydrated, moist, and all that. Okay. I usually put it here, put it on my hand. Okay. So good. I have bought a an aloe vera plant. I'll put some of that too. Right and that's how I do my TCA peel, guys. Okay. And I'll definitely take pictures of this for the next couple of days because with the dermal roller. I never, um, I totally forgot to take pictures on how my um, skin recovered after the little puncture wounds. But yeah, and I, I was happy with the results, by the way. But yeah, with the TCA peel, guys, it's amazing for your skin. So yeah, guys, if you like this content, this video, excuse me. Oh, this video content please like comment and subscribe remember I can emphasize enough help a girl out I'm trying to do these videos for you guys and you know I'm trying my best and you know it's not easy for us small youtubers to you know uh, get out there and always buy all these things and you know everybody's viewing them getting thousands of views but then nobody's subscribing and then you see that the same people are, are, are viewing it so come on, let's support each other, you know? So anyway, thank you guys. God bless. And like I said, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Later.